played a song for Callum that Peter played before, um, but since Peter asked to, uh, to play, I decided to switch to another one. Uh, I, the obvious reasons I was going to play the other one. Um, yeah, Robert's a, a musical hero of mine as much as Nick, really, and uh, it was a pleasure to meet him. I, as Peter said, you can't really understate the, uh, the um, importance of Robert's arrangements to Nick's songs, and <clears throat> you, you can't really understate the importance of Robert to uh, popular music arranging in general. I think he's had a massive influence on just how, how things are done and certainly he's probably the biggest influence on my arranging style and um, other, other people who do a lot of arrangements uh, in the industry, people like Jason Hazley, uh, very heavily influenced by Robert um, and a lot of people are only aware that he worked with Nick um, and I, I mean just, just if you fancy exploring other stuff that he's done, he's worked with Paul Weller, I think he did Paul Weller's Eocentric album. Um, he's done the last two Magic Numbers albums, and I think one of my favourite arrangements of his is um, a song called Joe's Ark, which is by Ben and Jason, which is on their album Hello. That's a, that's a really, really good uh, string arrangement, and um, I think probably the best, one of the best in, in popular music history. Um, right, I am set up. Working? Yeah, okay. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Um, this is a song of mine, as I said, this one's called Closed. Fifteen days since you cried. 